This is Joe Pugh for the Boxing Voice, joined for the first time, delighted. Lauren Price, how are you? Yeah, I'm uh, relaxed, but I'm looking forward to Saturday night, can't wait. Two, three days away, pro debut, elite, elite amateur, one of the best amateurs we've ever seen come out of GP, dropped yeah. off by that gold medal. How's the pressure? Um, I don't really think of it as pressure, you know, we just look at it as, you know, a new journey. Um, like you said, taking every box as an amateur. For me now, I'm just going to look forward to, you know, little step ups each time, but you only get one pro pro debut so I'm not going to enjoy it. And team wise I know you're still with Rob McCracken. Yeah. Up there at the press conference, Adam Smith said you belong to the best female he's ever worked with. Um, what's that like to be with someone who's worked with the likes of Anthony Josh or Carl Frost? You know that he's an established trainer. Oh I, I think very highly of Rob McCracken. For me he's helped me massively. Um, he's done a great job as well with you know GB boxing but yeah uh, it's very humbling you know for him to say that for me and it's, it's, yeah, it's pretty crazy, but um, I'm great and I'm honoured to, to have him by my set, side for this journey. Uh, Welsh boxing is at an all time high, obviously, after Joe Claudine is an astonishing second round KO. First, what did you make of that? And Welsh boxing as a whole, because it could be on your shoulders in the next couple of years. Yeah, 100%. I'm really happy for Joe, you know, I've trained alongside him. He's, he's one of the nicest boys, you know. And uh, yeah, he, what a shot, you know, I'm really excited. Um, I was buzzing for him, but also. So as well, obviously got well, the young lads coming up on the show as well. It was a good show. Some good Welsh talent coming through, like the likes of Kieran Jones, uh, Ben Crocker, people like that. So yeah, it's exciting times for Wales. And uh, Wales on an eye as well, you know, qualifying for the World Cup, put that in there. So um, yeah, I'm really, really buzzing. Definitely. And for yourself, I think you're moving down a bit of weight, but you're pressure rate 147. Yeah, 147. So at the, at the top there, we've got the likes of Jessica McCaskill kind of riding high. In what 12 18 months, did you see yourself getting up there? Yeah, like, like I said, I'll leave that to Rob, you know. Um, but obviously, with my amateur background, I can move a little bit quicker to, you know, I suppose someone else just starting off in the program. So, yeah, we'll just see. I'm just gonna, you know, enjoy my debut, take fight, each fight as it comes, and, and go from there. But yeah, 100%, that's, that's the main goal, you know, to become world champion, to go on be multi time world champion, and just be champion, take all the boxes. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm starting the journey on Saturday and I'm really looking forward to it. Is there any name that you'd love to fight just for kind of Lexi, just for yourself to tick that box at the minute? Um, no, not really. I'm just like, for me, I, I, you know, women's boxing is, is really on the eye. You've got the likes of, you know, Katie Taylor, who's, who's done massive things for, for women's boxing. Um, I'm really good friends, you know, with Chantal Cameron and Savannah Marshall and them the girls that are flying the flag and stuff like that. So, yeah, just I'm supporting women's boxing. Uh, I'm not going to, you know, think of any or call anyone out or stuff like that. That's just not me. But like I said, when the time comes, um, whoever got the belt at the time, then, yeah, then happy days. But uh, for me right now, I'm just looking forward to putting on a classic performance in my debut and um, just improving from me every fight. Just over a month ago, we had obviously the biggest female fight of the time with Taylor Sprano. I think 16,000 at MSG. We could be 60,000 at the Principality in about five years' time. Lauren Price headlining it. What's going to stop you? I know. Why not? That'd be a dream come true, you know. It'd be absolutely, uh, yeah, that's that's up there with the top, you know, to, to fight at the Principality in Cardiff. Uh, I, I, I was there, you know, I've watched AJ Box here, Kate Taylor's boxing herself, and, you know, it's, it's crazy. Um, like I said, I'm the Welsh people behind you as well. We're a small nation, but a proud nation when it comes to sport. So, yeah, that would be insane. Fantastic. Well, best of luck on Saturday. Get the win, then move on to bigger and better things. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Brilliant.